Hello pandas. Yeah, the world's still here and so are we. So yes, I am going to give it another go. We are gonna go dumpster diving today, but we are going to use the slightly higher precaution. It is gonna change things a little bit. Um, we might just have to put the dumpsters on hold for a little while. We'll see, we'll talk, but like, yeah, for now, let's just see what the landscape is like out there. Before I get too many people in the comments telling me that this is not a, an N95 respirator, I know, but the thing is, um, this, this uh, thing we're all worried about, it doesn't sound like it's particularly good at going uh, through the air, so this, this is purely to prevent me from touching any orifices in my face with my contaminated gloved hands. I'm using a two-part approach. It's part sanitation, part separation. Uh, I'm gonna keep my eye on things, uh, and who knows, we might end up in full lockdown, in which case it'd be illegal for me to even leave my house. So, gosh, that would be a fun vlog. Anyway, for now, this seems sufficient. <laughs> Alrighty. What was that? Some kind of sports back brace. Neat. Knees. Glove. It's a kind of a decent looking boot. Is there another one? Dude. Hmm. I have no idea why someone would throw those out. Those look sick. Those are some really, really cool looking high tops. And this, this right here, it's not for me, but I actually, uh, I actually have somebody in mind. I've been looking for something just like this. And then this over here, what is that? Leather. Bad Lieutenant. Looks good. Looks good. Looks like somebody is still getting in before me. I bet there's a decent motor in there. But unfortunately, my hunt for scrap metal is kind of... Kind of toned down to the next. Yeah, yeah, somebody's been in here. Maybe we'll just move on to the next location. Be apocalypse. Right? Uh, <laughs> <deadly>. <laughs> We're moving, so. Uh, I gotta move in a month, too. Oh, that's great. It's sort of. <laughs> I know. You got a whole stack. Thank oh, you. Yeah. <laughs> I got all these, too. Nice. The only thing I'll ask for you, if you don't mind, help me put this net on top. Oh, you got it, man. Okay, cool. I'm thinking about using that as kind of like a full cargo net. Oh, okay, okay, so maybe this on the back and then pull the other part. Yeah, something like that right here. Okay. Oh, so, that works. Yeah, that's not bad. Bob's your uncle. Nicely done. Thanks, huh? Yeah, no, thank you. Hope you guys do well out uh, back in Montreal. Oh, thanks so much, man. Thanks for your help, man. You too. That's not so bad. Got quite a bag full now. Decent, buddy. Pretty decent. Decent little stash out of here. Got 
Gotta love it. Huh, it's a pretty good one. Again, not too bad. These glasses are really fogging up. Can't waste that. It's more expensive than gas. I guess it always was. But it's more valuable than gold in times like these. Unless, you know, you value gold more than your health or the health of people around you, in which case. I suppose not. There. Woo! Mm. I should have seen that coming, really. Air conditioning doesn't seem to help. Okay, fog break. Oh yeah. Huh? Oh heck yeah. What's in there? Uh, it's a thingy. What is that? Oh, it's really heavy. It's really, really heavy. Ugh. Oh, it's like a, uh, I don't, I have no idea what that is. Yeah. Anything cool behind there? No, it's just like a deck. I need something to carry it all. <laughs> How is this one this week? Uh, are we? Whoop! That sounds good. Oof. That's a whole ass laptop. No cord? Oh, come on. That's probably why they threw it out. Oh well. Is it smashed? Well, the screen's good. Until Centrino Windows Vista. I mean, it's not good, but it'll have some, uh, it'll have some who knows what in it. That's something. Anybody who saw the uh, e-waste in Canada video will know why I'm not particularly hyped about that. Yeah, yeah. It's so, not um, worth much here. Yeah, this is definitely Hey. Presents for Thubby. Maybe. Uh, oh, analog in. Comes with the power cord. That's not bad. It's not bad. Well, it looks like it's got all the parts it requires, so we're gonna give that a go. Someone got a PS4. That looks like it was really cool. Hey. Hey there. How are you? I'm all right, you? I'm good. Are you uh, looking for bottles? I am. I can, I can bring you some. Would you? That'd be yeah. great. Oh, heck yeah, buddy. Ooh. Got that iPhone. Thank you so much. Yeah. No worries, have a good one. You too. Yes. Okay, so kindness is still around here somewhere. I wish I could find the back to that, because the red ones, well those are those are high end. Uh we'll set that aside. 
Okay, this one is gonna take me some time to extract, so give me one sec and I'll tell you how it goes. It's not too bad. It includes the, uh, it's got the part that uh, nice lady gave to me. Plus I found this. It's a container for a uh, champagne bottle. I don't know who that's targeted at, like artists. It's neat though. And some kid tossed their Pokemon cards. Yeah, he's got some of those, like, some of those old school styles. And uh, he's got, like, these are some really interesting rebacks. Like, look at those. He's gone over the, uh, he or she, I don't know. They're all, like, legit Pokemon cards. And then they've printed off the uh, images for some more high-end Pokemon cards, and then painted in the sparkles. The stuff you find. Another bro thinking of me. Thank you. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oof. Also, not bad. And another. Wow. Another laptop. This one's pretty jacked up, but I bet you there are still some good parts in it. It's fine. <laughs> Alrighty, folks, this is gonna be our last little, last little dash. I'm out of dumpsters. And I just like to do the, uh, do this route. Huh. Unfortunately, I checked the first half and it looks like it's already been pilfered. Oh shoot, so is this one. What the heck? Then why did that one have... These are weird times. At the same time, maybe not? I don't know, it's always hard to say. But it looks like there's still goodies out here, so that's good enough for me. There's one chilling right there. What the heck? Now, I'm not really one to focus on the negative, but I got to say, this whole situation has really been a bit of a buzzkill. I mean, normally I'd be happily pulling all sorts of stuff out that I could just immediately donate or something and, uh, well, it seems like that would be really irresponsible. So I can't really do that. Obviously I need to protect myself, but it's also about, uh, like, minimizing exposure to people around me. I wouldn't want to be responsible for, uh, for helping spread something like that around. And considering the volume of exposure that I get with, uh, with what I do here, you know, definitely need to take every possible precaution. But it puts me in a difficult place. Because as you can probably guess, there's no EI for someone like me. What the heck? Is that a cat? Valley Sportsman? Oh, I've always wanted one of those. That's so cool. Maybe someday. So there's no EI for me. I got to make my money. One way or another. So here I am. Hmm. Oh, 
overall, if I had to guess, I'd say there's probably going to be more bottles because of this. Which is a financial benefit for me. But... I like... I'm worried it's not going to be as much fun. Because I'm not able to, like, get as excited about all of the finds. definitely changed things for everybody which is fun in a way yep it's the mud season <sighs> so you can certainly still expect all sorts of videos but I'm thinking it might be a good time to focus on uh, more of the stuff that I can do from my house and I might switch to more uh, exploring like this and less dumpsters. Which I know isn't ideal, but I think it could be fun and it could just help, you know, maintain a bit of a feeling of normalcy. I hope I'm not coming across as a huge bummer because I am not bummed. I'm actually kind of stoked, but That'll be another video. And this one used to be really good, and then one day it just wasn't. Definitely just sprayed milk all over my head. Whatever. Nice. Don't need all that. home again. Now the process for treasures found is a little different as you might imagine. Ah. These are gonna sit out here in the garage for a week or so and then I'm gonna come at them with uh, isopropyl alcohol and give them a good uh, wipe down. And then, <laughs> and only then, will we see what we can make out of them. As I'm sure you can imagine, I'm being super selective with what I'm choosing to bring home. Because I just don't have the space for a whole lot of it. Yeah, it's definitely a radically different landscape for uh, bottle picking trash picking, and so forth. But, I still need to get out there and uh, do my best. At least until we all get uh, legally required to stay in our houses at all times. But, you know, I don't think it'll get that bad. And, uh, we're gonna do lots of other stuff to have some fun with it too, so I wouldn't worry about it. There'll be plenty going on here. Now, uh, one sec. Hmm. Never actually washed these before, so we're gonna see how this turns out. I got them because I thought they'd be, uh, Easy to keep clean. I think that's true. And I've only got a small amount of isopropyl alcohol left, so I gotta ration it out, which is why those things are gonna sit out there until I can get more. There will be more. Just gotta keep checking the store. So I'm basically gonna wipe down that and the camera. 
that's gonna be it for now. Ow! Regardless, thanks for coming along. Keep your chin up, leave it better than you found it, and keep washing your hands. <laughs>